That's about as far as we go today. One way or the other, neither is a town we'll reach before nightfall. The nearest way for us is back where we came from, where we were escorted with the most splendid catcalls that ever ground our histrionic successes. Who will lend me a hand to wipe off my perspiration? It has a nasty way of streaming into my mouth. Stand on your hat then, and let your perspiration water a more fruitful soil. <laughs> it's hopeless. <laughs> it's hopeless. Another stop. Another day's walk to the nearest town. Another day. It's an outrage how far these people move their towns away from us. <laughs> we won't strike a town until the day after tomorrow. Hurrah! That's luck for you. There's yet a day after tomorrow for us. And the women are still far behind us, crawling. They want the vote and they can't even walk. Well, we won't give them votes. That's settled. Down with votes for women! <laughs> Seems the devil himself can't take you. Neither your feet nor your tongue ever get tired. <laughs> you get on my nerves. Sit down and shut up for a moment. Me? <laughs> I am going there, to the lady of my heart. I will meet her and fetch her hither in my arms. <laughs> Clown. How can he laugh and play his games even now? We have an ascent to our souls. Our, our supply of food is running low and our shoes are dilapidated. Stop it! No reckoning. The number of our sins is great and the tale of our misfortunes is even greater. Holy Father, our flasks are empty. I would give what is left of our souls just for a smell of whiskey. Sit, my love. Rest up. We go no further today. <clears throat> your feet, your tender little feet must ache you. How unhappy that makes me. At the first opportunity, I will buy you an automobile. <laughs> and in the meantime, you may carry me off to now. <gasps> the beast of burden hears <laughs> and obeys. No one carried me. We have only one ass with us. <laughs> we can spend the night here. No. We shall stay at Hotel Never Was. Don't you like our night's lodgings? The bed is broad and wide, and certainly without vermin. Just feel the soft ground beneath you. Such a soft bed never you have slept in. And you shall have a cover embroidered with moon and stars, such a cover as no royal bride ever possessed. You're laughing and I feel like crying. Crying? Why? <laughs> you shame the sun which favors you with its setting splendor. Look and be inspired. Yes, look and expire. Oh, look and shout with ecstasy. Uh, look and burst. <laughs> Stop it or I'll start bawling too. <laughs> Cheer them up, clown. Ladies and gentlemen, I have it. Ladies and gentlemen, I have it. <laughs> what have you? Cheerfulness. Oh. <laughs> Go bury yourself, clown. In the form of a bottle of whiskey. A bottle of whiskey? <laughs> a bottle of whiskey? <laughs> whiskey. Yes, a bottle of whiskey. Hidden and preserved for a moment such as this. A moment of masculine depression and feminine tears. <laughs> you call that a bottle? It's hardly a flask. A thimble! A, a, a dropper! But for the six of us! But it's whiskey, my children! <clears throat> now that's whiskey for ya. The saloon keeper from whom I hooked it will become a teetotaler from sheer despair. Fine! <laughs> Small quantity, but excellent quality. 
<laughs> Seems to be good whiskey. <laughs> my comedian, my comedian, his head is in the right place. Oh, but why didn't you nab a larger bottle? Oh, my beloved, I had to take into consideration both the quality of the whiskey and the size of my pocket. If only there were enough to go around. Oh, I feel like crying again. Oh, oh cheer up. There will be enough for us all. Here, smell it again. Yes. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. <laughs> good, 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 good. If you are so cheered by the mere smell of it, what would you think after a drink? Wait, I'll join you. I will teach you a new roundel, which we will perform in our next presentation of Hamlet, to the great edification of our esteemed audience. Oh. The place is clear. <laughs> <laughs> now for dance and play. Join hands and form a circle. But uh, you villains, stay on the outside of it. <laughs> you are to try to get in, and we dance and are not to let you in without getting out of step. Understand? Yep. Then. To be or not to be, <laughs> that is the question. That is the question. That is the question. He who would enter in, jump, he must over us. If over he could not, he must get under us. Tra la la, tra la la, over us, under us. Tra la la, tra la la, under us, over us. Now we are jolly, jolly are we. That is the question, that is the question, that is the question. In life to gain success, elbow your way through. Don't jostle the next one, or else they'll jostle you. Tra la la, tra la la, over us, under us. Tra la la, tra la la, under us, over us. Now we are jolly, jolly are we. To be or not to be. A dollar. A dollar. A dollar. My hands, my hands, let go of my hands. Who's break them? Oh, these women's hands are so frail. Just look at them now. Hey. Let go of my hand. I think it is you who are holding fast to mine. <laughs> Why should I be holding on to you? If you pick up the dollar, what's yours is mine, you know. Then let go of my hand, and I'll pick it up. <laughs> no, I'd rather pick it up myself. I expected something like that from you. Just let go of my hands, that's all. <laughs> <laughs> it's a huge joke. <laughs> we must contemplate the dollar with religious reverence. Be <laughs> quiet, I say! A dollar, a real dollar, is spread out before us in the midst of our circle, and everything within us draws us towards it, draws us on irresistibly. Be <laughs> quiet! Remember, you are before the ruler, before the almighty. On your knees before him and pray. On your knees! <laughs> Ha ha ha! Oh, clown! You are not worthy of the serious mask you wear! You do not appreciate true divine majesty! <laughs> On your knees, or you will get <laughs> the whiskey! <laughs> oh, holy dollar! Oh, mighty ruler of the universe, before thee we kneel in the dust and send toward thee our most tearful and heartfelt prayers. Our hands are bound, but our hearts strive towards thee and our souls yearn for thee. Oh, great king of kings, thou who bringest together those who are separated, and separate us those who are near. Get back the dollar! Get back the dollar! You can't take it from me, it's mine. It was lying under my bundle. Get back the dollar! Get back the dollar! Moreover, whom should I give it to? Should I give it to you? You? Mm -hmm.
you. <laughs> he is right. It is his. He has the dollar, therefore it is his. <laughs> and I was going to crawl on my knees and pick it up with my teeth. <laughs> but he got there before me. <laughs> You've not let go of me. No! <laughs> Heaven and hell, I feel like crushing you. <laughs> Now we drink, <laughs> and the first drink is the fillings. <laughs> drink, lucky one. <laughs> Good shot! Now, I will drink all that's left in the bottle. <laughs> <laughs> he who would enter in jump he must over us oh, 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 oh holy dollar oh almighty ruler of the world oh king of kings <laughs> don't you all think that if I have the dollar and you have it not that I now partake a bit of its majesty that means that I am now a part of its majesty. That means that I am the almighty dollar's plenipotentiary, and therefore I am the almighty ruler himself. On your knees before me! <laughs> well roared, lion. But you forgot to hide your jackass's ears. <laughs> it is one's consciousness of power. Oh. I know, and you know. But if I have the money, I have the say. the say. Remember, none of you has a cent to his name. The whiskey is gone. I did my job well. I drank it to the last drop. <laughs> yes, to the last drop. This evening, you shall have bread and sausage. But very small portions too, for tomorrow is another day. Not till the day after tomorrow shall we reach the town, but that doesn't mean that you get anything to eat then either. But I, 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 <laughs> oh holy dollar, oh almighty dollar, he who does my bidding shall not be without food. What? <laughs> oh my dear beloved one! <laughs> Oh. oh, my power already makes itself felt. <laughs> Go with him, you. He sought my love for a long time, and now he shall have it. What? You? I hate you, traitor. I have always loved genius. You are the wisest of the wise. I adore you. Oh, frailty. Thy name is woman. Come into my other arm. Up! Now I have all of power and all of love. <laughs> Don't call it love. Call it servility. <laughs> but now I have something more important to carry out. My vassals. I mean you all. Oh. <laughs> I have decided we shall not stay here overnight. We shall proceed further. How so? We go forward tonight. <laughs> oh. And you have so decided. I have so decided, and that in itself should be enough. But due to an old habit, I shall explain to you oh, why. Oh, keep your explanations to yourself, and better not disturb my contemplation of the sunset. <laughs> 
I'll have you put down on the blacklist. It will go ill with you for your speeches against me. Ooh. Now <laughs> then, without an explanation, we will go, and at once. <laughs> Very well then, I go alone. No, no, no! What do you mean? I go with you. And I. Your loyalty gratifies me very much. What the deuce is urging you to go? I wanted to explain it to you, but now no more. I owe you no explanations. I, you explanations. I have decided I wish to go, and that is sufficient. <laughs> he plays this comedy wonderfully. Would you have ever suspected there was that much wit in his cabbage head? Oh, oh you, you darling. darling! I wouldn't give him even a single glance. <laughs> Still another on the blacklist. I'll tell you this much. I have decided... Oh, how long will you keep this up? <laughs> that if I am to pay for your food, I will not carry any baggage. You will divide my bundles among you, and of course, those of you who are on the blacklist, i.e. you two, will get the heaviest share. <laughs> you heard me. Now move. We shall proceed to the nearest town, which is 30 miles away. Now then, I'm off. Bon voyage! <laughs> and with me fares His Majesty the Dollar and your meals for tomorrow. We're coming, oh, we're coming! We're coming. Uh, I'll go along. You're a scoundrel and a mean fellow. I am no fellow of yours. I am master and bread giver. I'll crush you in a moment. <laughs> you threaten me. Let's go. We'll pick up the trunk. And we'll settle the score with him some other time, okay? It's he who has a dollar now. I'll get him yet. First, put one of my bundles on your back. <gasps> One of your <laughs> bundles on my whoa, back? Whoa, whoa. And for all I care, you can put it on your head or between your teeth. <gasps> well, put the bundle on the trunk! Huh? Look here. Are you joking or are you in earnest? I never joke. So you are in earnest? I'll make no explanations. Do you think that just because you have the dollar? The holy dollar, the almighty dollar, the king of kings. That therefore you are the master? Bread giver and provider. And that we must? Do what I bid you to. So, you are in earnest? Just take the baggage and follow me. Then, I declare a revolution! <laughs> a revolution. A bloody one, if need be. And I shall be the first to let your blood, you scoundrel. <laughs> if that is the case, then I have nothing to say to you. Those who wish, come along. No, you shall not go until you give up the dollar. Oh, it is to laugh. The dollar, please, or... Let there be blood! <laughs> ah, blood, blood. I'm not one to keep out of a fight. Nor I. Nor I. To whom shall I give it up? <laughs> shall I give it to you? You? Certainly not you. That <laughs> argument will not work any longer. You are to give up the dollar to all of us. At the first opportunity, we will make change and divide it into equal parts. Divide it, divide it, divide it. And I will even be so good as to give you a share. <laughs> I'd rather give him a sound thrashing. It shall be as I say. Give up the dollar. My comedian, my comedian. I'm sick of you. Give up the dollar. Best you get out of the way, or you may get the punch that I reserve for the master and bread giver. Give up the dollar to him, do you hear? The give dollar! Give, up, give, give it up! The dollar! The dollar. No. Then we will tear up all the hair on your cabbage head. Quick, the dollar! No. I got it! <laughs> Bandits! Thieves! Silence! Or I'll shut your mouth. <laughs> now that is what I call a successful and bloodless revolution. Except for a little fright and heart oh. palpitation on the part of the late <laughs> master and bread giver. <laughs> Look, someone is coming. Perhaps he'll be able to make change and we can divide the dollar at once. <laughs> I'm confused. How, how can we divide that into equal parts? You're angry with me, but 
I was only toying with him so as to get a dollar out of him. And now you want to trick me out of my share of it. No, it doesn't work. <laughs> it doesn't work. Though. Does it? No, okay. Yeah, all right. Um, it's impossible. It's absolutely impossible. If it were 96 cents or 102 cents... Excuse me, sir. Perhaps you would have change of a dollar in dimes, nickels, and quarters? Change for a dollar? Yes. I think I might. <laughs> yeah. hey. Hands up! But, sir, <laughs> we are altogether peaceful folk. <laughs> then you won't mind buying me dinner. Money, 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 money. Money! Huh. A dollar and a date. Cool. <laughs> I won't tell if you won't. I certainly didn't see that coming. 